To start creating your own wizard theme, open the Manage Effects window, click on the Wizard Themes tab, and then click on Create down at the bottom. Name your theme and hit OK. The Theme Creation User Interface has three sections. Three tabs that you'll go through at the top left, information for those tabs shown in the middle, and a timeline at the bottom. The basic wizard theme starts with a starting and ending blank slide and a dynamic section in the middle. A dynamic section is where you'll add the styles and transitions that you want Photopia to apply as you go through the wizard to create a show. To choose your effects for your dynamic section, simply go through the Styles and Transitions tabs at the top and add your effects. The Settings tab is where you'll name this section, determine whether the section is optional, and give a recommended amount of images for this section. You can add more dynamic sections here, and each dynamic section can have a different set of effects assigned to it. If you were creating a wedding theme, for example, you might have three dynamic sections with different effects. One section for bride images, one section for groom images, and one for them as a couple. You can also add static slides. These are useful if you want the theme to apply a specific slide style at a specific time in the show. For example, we can add a static slide, then choose a title slide that the wizard will use for this section. If you choose a slide style that has a caption layer in it, you'll want to enter some text as a prompt, telling the user what type of text to add for this slide. Static slides can only have one slide style applied to it, where dynamic sections can have as many as you'd like. Once you have your sections of your theme set, you'll go up to the Theme Settings tab and set the background for the show, and choose a recommended music style. The Theme Information tab is where you can name or rename your theme, add more information about this theme, and give your theme a thumbnail. From here, you can save it to your computer, making it available in your themes list, or export it if you'd like to share your theme with other Photopia users.